What are some of the strange requests that buyers make from you in the sales process? I'm Scott Silverbells, July 29th, 2017. 4.43 in the afternoon, perfect day to talk about sales and a perfect day to talk about requests that people make of you. I'm here in Sacramento, California. So this next one is go to church. Now I gotta tell you, in 2000 I knew a sales guy that literally made a sale by telling the people, I'll go to your church and I'll get baptized to your religion. And you know what? He did it. He did it in order to close the deal. And sometimes people make strange requests of you and they say, hey, if you want my business, you gotta go to church with me. Now. I got to tell you, it's not something that I would do, and your morals are really going to guide you on this process and what you decide to do. I'm not you. I'm just going to tell you that if, if that's what it takes to make a sale, you're lying to that person and saying, I'm going to join your fun and I'm going to join in with you, and uh, yeah, I'll go, I'll go do your religion thing. Just not something that I would do. This is just my personal decision. This is just something that you really do need to be aware of because it does happen. And I live here in California, so I probably get away with a little bit better. But if you live in the Bible Belt here in the United States, it may be a different story. It may be that that's what you got to do to make the sell. Once again, I'm not you. <laughs> I'm not telling you what you should or shouldn't do. I'm just saying in this instance, you should be prepared that there are times people make a request. And they're like, if you want me to buy your product, your service, your widget, your gizmo, you're coming to church with me and you're going to listen to the preacher for a couple of hours. Right? And it could be that you don't like it. could be that you do like it. It could be it's for you. could be it's not for you. But be prepared. Sometimes people will ask you to do some weird stuff to make a sale, to make a purchase, and it could be a test, right? So there you go. They could ask you to go to a religious church activity or festival in order for you to make the sale, and you got to know that it does happen. Now, I, I wouldn't mind going to a festival because I like food, right? But if you're saying you got to come sit and listen to a preacher, that's not my thing. I'd rather be outside, you know, rather go to the ocean. I'd rather do a lot of other stuff. But that's just me and I'm not you. Now, if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, leave a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right, to the left, there's a subscribe button. You know what you gotta do, you gotta subscribe. And then last of all, you can send it out to all your friends via Stumble Upon, Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus. Why not even LinkedIn? Scott Silverbell. We'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.